Alright, hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome back to Burning Bot's going to go burn things, or hit things with Fro Frost Club. You know, when I say Burning Bot, I realize that that totally could refer to, uh, uh, current political climate related things. Let's not talk about- I, uh, wait, what? Oh god, I just realized there's an, a really angry one. This is bad? Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna switch this, and we're just going to go straight through the water. Screw you guys. By the way, if it's... It's lagging again, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Here's the question. Does he take damage in water? Okay, I'm gonna dodge that. So these guys... Just seem to be... Okay, on fire and... Jesus, this game's performance is all over the map. Alright, let's switch back to the Burning Golem before everything bad that could ever happen happens to me. I'm just gonna sprint away. Unfortunately, I don't know if there's... Wow. It's kind of the best. I don't know if there's... Um... I'm just gonna hit him a bunch. There we go. Okay. Actually, you know what? Who needs to hit people a bunch? I can just use and abuse the fact that I've got... a self-healing golem and horrible lag. If we're lucky, we can save this fox man. Cool, we got him. That should do it for the rats. But they set that fire. Our leader is trapped. He might die here. Alright, so what fire are we talking about? Wait, what? Build a stone goliath. Oh. So that's how we get stone goliaths. Uh, we had to unlock it by talking to that one random dude. Gotcha. Alright, well, whatever. I'll take it. Let's get out of here. It looks like their performance is stabilized. I don't know... Oh, you know what? It's probably because it's loading level chunks and stuff like that still. Uh, the Trials and Tribulations of Indie Games. Alright, uh, Stone Golem. Froze Golem. There we go. Stone Golem. What? Alright, hold on. Experiments. So we have Stone Golems now. So this is the basic one. This is this one. So, apparently we can just already make the, uh, frost head. Kill 15 snow, uh, snow golems, 300 ice damage, kill a grabber with stone goliath in overdrive mode. Huh. Alright, so, like, the ice damage should be really easy to do, and the snow golems I don't know so much about. Either way, let's do golem construction. So, that head, obviously. So, regenerates from freezing effects. HP... Honestly, we're probably going to want to go with the just basic stone across the board. Uh, just because the frost one could screw me up, specifically in the desert here. Oh, it's got a wheel. Okay. At high temperature, speed and attack are increased. Overdrive. Let's see. Ram, so we dash forward. Boost to strengthen attack speed. Meteor shower. Uh, at level 15. we got to be getting close. We're 13. Slow and strong Goliath. Safest robot. Series of crash tests by the ACR... A-R-C-A-P. R-CAP. Mm. Anyway. Oh, we block. Hold a block for 10 seconds and more and release a... Okay, so there's like a shockwave. So we're currently very much on fire. I'm okay with this. So that's an iron. We can't do that. We do have the Mighty Mace of Pain. Which better freaking equip. There we go. Okay. But I'm going to have to make a, um, a stone fiery ca cavern. Okay, I'll check to see if I have a one of that. We might have, we definitely have the chitin. Okay. Yeah, let's go with the machine gun. I think. So what do we need for that? Chitin, bones, stone blocks. Okay, that should be easy enough. So, well, there's the chitin. There's a bone. And do we have stone blocks? I could always go make some. Uh, question is, do I have to fabricate them here? Oh, we need resin. From trees. Alright, let's go punch down some trees until we get the resin that we need. It's twigs. Small question about whether or not we're going to be able to get resin in the desert. Right, I forgot. Going to new territories, just in general, 
means horrible, horrible performance issues. Like, truly bad. What are these suckers? Sleepy golem critters. Okay, well... For better or worse... Okay, we can kind of knock him down, but it doesn't quite work the way we want it to. Well, I'll take it. Okay. So, boost does not work nearly as well as I would like it to. But that's okay. Uh, you know, I was hoping it would actually, you know, give me a huge damage boost or something. No dice. Well, whatever. So, yeah, no... No resin while we're out here. Let's check this chest. Yeah, I figured as much. So, the enemies respawn. The rewards do not. Let's get out of here. Let's go... I mean, we've made the... Hmm. We've made the, um... The wooden burning golem. So, honestly, that's going to be the one I use for this area. I guess let's see if I can get any resin in here. Chances are... Yeah, if we're cold, we move slow. Figured as much. Let's wait for the heat to come back. Then we can actually move again. There we go. I think he keeps going until... Uh, not infinitely, necessarily, but... Where go? Dead tree have any resin in it? Nope, just logs. Alright, unfortunate. But yeah, as soon as we deal with that fire that it told me to deal with. I we shouldn't have any problem. Where? What? Huh? Must have missed the entry here. Interesting. Stone golems are completely neutral. They won't attack you until, uh, until you actually get violent against them. Anyway, this... Oh, right. There was the bridge. There's This is the fox man. I love it how it tell, tells me to make a stone golem when I you can make a burning golem that just does not care about burning trees at all. Eh, let's try that. There he is. Because, I mean, who cares if we're on fire? I don't. I don't at all. Hi. Ventus the Red. Whew! That was getting hot. I'm sure I'm lucky you happen to find your... Uh, happen along in your fire... Proof stone pants. How'd you find me, stone pants? Uh, these are not stone. Whatever. Uh, well, my name is actually. Never mind. Stone pants is fine. Okay, so I'm not from this world, and friend told me you might know a way to get home. Home? Ah, yes, the world your shard chipped off of far away long ago. Yes, yes. This idea is passed into legend for my people. Most are happy enough where they are, so they consider this to be a story. But I know better. I know the way to this home you speak of. In happier times, I would help you freely. But, Stone Pants, these are not happy times for the foxes. Uh, what's wrong? The rats claim to have a terrible weapon capable of wiping out the entire Forest Brotherhood in an instant, Stone Pants. They call it the Double Orbiter. We know nothing about it at all, except where it is kept. A locked black chest deep within the rat's compound. And someone who seems to be an ally to the rats, like you might be able to get inside and find out just what they're planning. I see, cloak and dagger type stuff, I like it. But I'm just getting, I'm just another stranger to them. Why would they let me in? Uh, the Forest Brotherhood and the Vermafia are lifelong enemies. And we know, we each know much about the other. This beautiful amulet I wear is one of a kind and signifies that I'm a leader of the Brotherhood. If you bring it to them and say that you have killed me in single combat, they will recognize it and may believe you. Forget it, Fox Boss. I can't lie. I'm just too good of a person to help you save your people, I guess. No. Alright. I'll do it. Grr. Lie. Steal. Insult. Look out, rats. Here I come. Alright. So we get a mythical barbarian stone axe. And now we go talk to the bandit. Yeah, doing quests is how you get experience in this game. Kind of sucks. I was really hoping that it would just be, like, everything. But no dice. Anyway, I assume we're going to a new biome today. I could continue leveling, but honestly, grinding is, like, the least interesting thing I could possibly do. Let's beat up this guy. Oh, we've already unlocked the spare part uh, for the ice golem. Useful. Yeah, like, 
like, how much... Oh, shit. Now, the problem is he keeps whacking me with his tail, and if I'm not constantly hitting him... Yeah. This is worthless. I'm just gonna break my weapon trying to kill it. The problem is we ignite things around us, and that is not very effective against enemies that heal from being on fire. Complete waste of time. Alright, uh, yep. It is having me come here. So I assume we're going to the doorway into the lawless land. So we could go to the vile wood. Let's go to the vile wood for for the time being. I don't know if this is actually going to be quest relevant, but you know what? It's a new area that we haven't been to yet, and it looks like, you know, maybe we can gain something from it. I'll have to see what the, um... Oh, shoot. What is it? I'll have to see what the... The next, like, steps, wood golem and ice golem are. Like, what, what the requirements are. Because I know there's the snow golem one, but I've already forgotten the rest. Most of them are probably annoying. Like, uh, 30 revolver kills might be a little bit beyond what I can normally do. We'll see. Let's see. Oh, right. There's also the overdrive mode. Yeah. Yeah. Still wish there was no durability system in this game. That always... I don't know. That always ends up being, like, really frustrating to me. For a large number of reasons. That and loading screens. I hate long loading screens. Like, this game's interesting, but man, the optimization, several other things, they're just painful. Not terrible, just just kind of just kind of rough. Could be worse, but kind of rough. Ah, uh, let's see. I did not realize how many YouTubers were playing this game. I looked at the search results once, and I'm like, I am not alone in playing this. Which is weird, because I've, like, heard nobody talking about it. But then again, I've actually been, like... Seriously out of the loop for quite a while as far as, like, YouTubers, uh, go just because, you know, I'm gearing up to move out of my, uh, my current home and probably to Dallas, Texas, which is going to be really fun, but you can't uproot your life like that without spending an inordinate amount of time, um, preparing and combo that with, uh, oh shoot, I guess with shell visiting and allergies uh, it's, you know, mid, mid-May around here, the trees, like, you, uh, Shell is visiting, and she's got this nice red, uh, Yaris. It's covered in, like, a thin yellow film at all times because of the sheer amount of pollen in the air, and, oh, that stuff is killer. My eyes, my face, my nose, everything is burning. So I've been, like, cutting back on shows until I can, you know, get the time and the health to start recording stuff again, but it's still just like, I am so, so behind and in so much trouble. It's not so bad. It was a bit rough. All right, let's see, let's see what's it up at the vile wood. This place seemed interesting enough. So let's, let's go see if we can buy stuff from a merchant. Or get a quest or something. I don't know. What do you have to say? Uh, cursed. You look sad. Kind of helped. Okay, so what's this guy want? Let's see, scroll a spell that makes spirits return to the land of the dead. I can go to that place and kill them. Last, looking for the scroll really took it out of me. Okay. So we're gonna go read a scroll and kill some people. So let's track that. Let's go kill some spirits. Now, admittedly, let's... Actually, before this, I like this golem, but he's not gonna automatically heal. If we end up having to fight something hard, that's gonna be problems. So, let's go here. Let's not... Uh... Oh, right, I only have the option to deconstruct and repair, but I, I still can't bring anything back up to full health. Boop, boop, boop. There's no transitionary animation there, it's just complete instant. Funny. Alright, anyway, let's, let's go with the wooden one. It's faster right now. Obviously. Actually, question. I gotta figure out where to get resin from. Oh, you know what? It's probably only from fir trees. Yes, this is true. Well, let's get some trees while we're here. We're gonna need them anyway. 
it looks like we've, we've got spiders again. So this might not actually be a bad place to go back to our grinding. The, the longhorn things were kind of annoying. But, you know, the rest... The rest of the enemies, specifically the spiders, were pretty fun to fight. Hopefully I don't have to fight another one of those, uh, Mr. Skeletals. I've had enough duding for my life, and I don't feel like dealing with it. Uh, repeatedly here. Okay. I'm just gonna keep punching trees. There we go. Uh... So we're here, I guess we read the scroll? Where is, where is scroll? There's scroll. Use. Oh, sweet lordy. So, being in the center, bad move. Let's try Stolen Golem. Okay, this is kind of the worst. Um... Alright, well, I'm just gonna... <sighs> I... Not sure. What do you want? Let's see what kind of place is it? It's Arena. Not much of an audience. Okay. So he's got birds. Let's track Fluff and Feather. That seems like it might be a little bit more doable. Apparently we have to go kill a bunch of birds. However, for the time being, seeing as my stuff is completely broken, we should go fix it because obviously I'm not going to be able to do anything. Uh, well, let's try and at least finish one quest today. The ghosts seem completely undoable, so let's rebuild. That was nonsense. Like, my... My golems melted in an instant. I really get the feeling... Oh, like, honestly, this is an early access title, so go freaking figure. Uh, that you're going to run into this situation. Uh, where, you know, things are poorly balanced and awkward. But, like, it really does feel like they're just like, alright, we're at the stage where we can put it out. Playtesting, what's that? Uh, that's what the players will do, right? And that is... Oh, I just realized. Don't have any weapons here. Christ. Okay. Um... Okay, they lost interest for some reason. Now spider's trying to kill them. This is the weirdest thing. Oh, they explode. Those are exploding dodos. Those are exploding dodos! Apparently. This is news to me. I Maybe that was there in the... Alright, whatever. Well, we got that, and now we have a frozen... My inventory is full. Okay, fine. Let's see. Do I have just a basic broken-looking wooden sword? Here, hand catapult. This is nice that they're... That they actually show up along the way. Okay, so we still have the pygmy ghost to kill. I'm still level 13. And all my golems have broken once once again. This is ridiculous. What did I make them out of? Paper? I totally did. The I my golems, the reason why I can move them around, the reason why they work, completely made out of paper mache. And nothing else. I'm honestly a bit flabbergasted and a lot concerned. I mean, what the heck do I do here? They're just gonna... They're just gonna melt my golems. Like... 
Oh, uh, right. Uh, Club of Coolness, 34 damage. 32. We'll go with the Club of Coolness. Okay, so we can have the Mighty Mace of Pain. There's also the Barbarian Axe. You know what? We're going with the Barbarian Axe. For better or worse. There's also a Frozen Mace. But yeah, I'd love to kill at least one of the Pygmies. Like, if I could kill them slowly. Lure them out or something. Use ranged weapons? Didn't work. Okay. So apparently that skull thing blocks attacks. He's burning. We're going to want to switch to Stone Golem. Okay, we broke his AI. We get a bunch of cool resources. Okay, so here's how we're going to kill them. Repetition. Unfortunately, if it's raining, that means we want to switch to this sucker. Because this sucker heals in water. Oh, you can't fight things? You can't fight things... In your menu? That's really annoying. I mean, we're okay, but still annoying. Okay, uh, so we want to equip the Club of Coolness and an Amazing Fiery Catapult. Cool. So yeah, I have some kind of healing here. Oh! Are you... It's level 13! Why does it do 300 damage? What am I... What am I supposed to do? I was blocking. Uh, really? This is kind of stupid. This is kind of really stupid. At least the spider can't kill me. We should probably switch to our one non not dead yet golem. Yeah, I, I don't know, man. I, I don't know. I guess I'm going to have to do some desert farming. We'll do that. We'll do that in the next episode. I'm just going to go hit things in the desert as some kind of immortal hell beast up until I can get to the point where I don't get one shot by ghost pygmies. What? Like, did I forget to add armor to these things? No, they just do stupid damage. Unless, I mean, okay, let's, let's go to the journal. Evil spirits. So either they do a stupid amount of damage for unknown reasons, or, I don't know. I don't, I don't have an explanation. I just have mild amounts of shock and anger. <laughs> uh, maybe I should have read the quest descriptions. They just feel random, randomly generated and not too interesting. So I was just like, ah, eh, we'll skip it this time. I'll have to look it up, or I'll have to go do grinding, and I'm not sure which. Either way, though, see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.